My name is Elisa McKay, and um, I'm a spiritual being um, teaching a collage art class today. Um, I've been doing collage for about 40 years. This class is for breast cancer survivors. What it does, it's, it's relaxing. At the, at the onset, it might not be because some people are not sure what they want to do, how they want to do it, but you can see that once they get into it, they're, they're relaxed and they're, they're, they're finding their own spirit of art. Today's event was so incredible. I've always admired Alyssa McKay's work. So when I heard that she was gonna be presenting today, I got really excited. This is so important because at first I remember feeling that insecurity in myself and then having the other women go, oh, this is good and how about this? And then when you hear them getting into their groove, it inspires you to get into your groove. Because, you know, I've never considered myself an artist in this way. Um, I'm pretty flat. I do things very two-dimensional. And um, to be able to, to have something lift off of, off of the sheet, it was like, oh, I could do that? I didn't know I could do that. It's like a sisterhood. It makes you more relaxed to see more people that have the same breast cancer like you. It makes you feel more comfortable and have some fun with people that are going through the same situation like you. So my collage art is representing me losing my breast to breast cancer. I finished treatment last year. I got diagnosed in 2019 and I'm young. So for me, it was hard. Um, and it was a tough decision. It took me months to decide what I wanted to do about my breasts. But after going through chemo and all the treatment, I didn't want to go through this again. So although the cancer was in one breast, I decided to get rid of both. They were reconstructed. Um, and I just got my nipples 3D tattooed in the States. <laughs> so they, they're supposed to look real. And um, I grieved for a while. I think I'm comfortable now in my skin, but I just wanted to show, like put that feeling onto this canvas, you know, because I don't think a lot of people talk about the grief of losing, you know, your breast to cancer. Oh, I'm truly happy to be a part of something like this. You know, I feel like um, as a member of the community, um, I, I, I'm, I do various things. Um, this is the first time I've done this particular kind of um, teaching to breast cancer survivors and it touches my heart. Yeah, I'm, I'm really happy to be a part of this. 